Welcome back to Panzercore 2, folks. In the last episode, we invaded Poland, Poland North scenario, and we did quite well. So now we're going to continue on. Uh, I do apologize for the sound being a little bit etchy in the first... Uh... Alice Clark, hey, General. I've got good news for you. Your successes in the Danzig Corridor, coupled with von Rundstedt's advances south of you, have virtually encircled the Polish capital of Warsaw. In order to prevent our enemy from establishing a second line, I'm ordering you deep into the Polish interior. Your ultimate objective lies all the way in distant Vlodova, here on the Bug River. Along the way, our friends in the Luftwaffe have requested you to pacify the eastern outskirts of Warsaw. This airfield here houses the last vestiges of the Polish Air Force, and clearing them out will grant us complete dominance of the skies. Forward elements of 10th Army have secured Pulavi here, but they lack the resources to advance on their own. I suggest reinforcing them if necessary. We don't want the Poles to retake the airfield we're currently holding on to. Good luck here, General. Thank you. Yeah, as I was saying, I'm sorry that the at least my voice was a little bit uh, uh, distorted in the first one. I, for some reason, my sound settings weren't as they normally are. So uh, yeah, I'm sorry about that. And I also think that the audio of the game was maybe a little bit loud. So I'll fix that in just a second. But we will end the briefing here. And we got a hero. Stefan Wolf, who has superior maneuver, gets plus one in initiative for each part of movement speed advantage over the enemy. Okay, cool, cool. So we'll close that. Now, let's just see uh, options, audio. We'll turn down the music a little bit. Yeah, turn down the music like that. I think that'll do. I think the sound effects was okay. Maybe a little bit loud. Pull it down a little bit. Okay. So, resume the game. Alrighty, 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 alrighty. So, here in this scenario, we get a few more deployment points. In the last one we had 36, now we have 45. And we have 2,082 prestige. And right now we could get a bonus of 200% if we won on turn one, which is not gonna happen. But we need to reinforce our guys that took damage. And then we need to figure out what units we want to get. So for the infantry, I think I'll just do regular replacements. But for the tanks, I'll do elite. For the recon, I think I'll do regular. And for the artillery, I'll do elite replacements as well. And that's it. Alrighty. Let's have a look at deploying these things. Well, actually, we should look at what we want to buy first, so let's do that. Radio. so what do we have here? Uh, let's take a look at what we can buy. Buy... Pioneers? Actually, I want to see... So there are a few rivers here. One, two that we maybe want to cross. So it might not be bad with some bridge engineers or broken engineers. I think we'll get that. And they only cost one. That would leave us with eight remaining. So let's buy a broken pioneer with some trucks. Uh, add those to the basket then I think I want another bear infantry hmm 
And I don't think I want to overstrength anything. So that's a total cost of four. That leaves us five points. Hmm. Now, if we take a look at you, 12. So I'm looking at the soft and hard attack that we have over here. So the 38 ton is outright better in those and also in initiative and ground defense. So I think we'll upgrade our tanks to that. Let's have a look at you. Same thing, just outright better. So I think we'll upgrade all our tanks to uh, Panzer 38 tons. They cost the same amount of units. So we'll do that. I think I want another recon. Uh, so add you to the basket. That takes us up to 45, leaving us three points. How much is a fighter? Three points. Tactical bomber. The Stuka is three, the BF-110 is two, so if we took a BF-110, so the Stuka is far better at attacking uh, ground, but the, the BF-110 can also do a little bit of air attack, which actually is quite nice to have, because that means that if our actual fighters, our BF-109s, can inflict uh, enough damage that they almost take out a fighter, then this guy could finish it off. But buying him would leave us with one point. What can we get for one point? We can get a, another Brücken Pioneer, but I don't think I want another one of those. We could get a pack. But they are only any good against tanks. Anything else, they suck. We could get a 2 centimeter or 3.7 centimeter flak, but I don't want that. We can't get any artillery. We could get another 10.5 centimeter. Actually, what we could do. Yeah. Because we have a 10.5 centimeter uh, artillery now, we could upgrade that to a 15 centimeter and get that. I think we're going to do that. Add to basket. So that's a total of eight, and we have nine. Let's buy those. And then we will upgrade you to you. Upgrade. So that's two 15 centimeters that we have. That is quite nice. And then we wanted to upgrade our tanks as well to the 38 tons. That's a lot of the uh, prestige that we're spending, but that's okay. Spending all this prestige also means that we hopefully can win the scenario faster. Oh, and these guys, they don't have trucks. So we want to give them trucks. There we go. That leaves us 274. Okay. And a pretty decent strength, uh, I think. So I think we'll place our Brücken Pioneer here so that we can immediately move in and get everything else on across. Then we will put our P-51 
Pioneera here. We'll stick a bear there. And a bear here, I think. And the last bear over here. We'll put a recon over here and over here. Actually, I think I want that recon there and then I want the pioneers there. Tank back here. Panzer. Panzer there. Panzer there. Panzer there. Artillery there. Artillery. Uh, undeploy you. Artillery here. You. Here. And then it's our planes which we need to put in here. Alright. That is everything deployed. We are dirt poor but powerful. So let's end the deployment. Oh no, we shall not end the deployment because we need to assign a hero. Now he had movement. Um, so here we can assign the hero. Superior maneuver. Gets plus one initiative for each point of movement speed advantage over the enemy. So I think we'll assign you to that tank. We can see that here that he is there. And let's have a look at awards. So heroic defense, it's all level zero. So they haven't actually won the awards, I think. No, we haven't won any awards left yet on that guy. Do any of our units have awards, I wonder? Doesn't look like it. I think the awards, they yeah, have medals over there. So none of our units have medals yet. Okay. That's a shame. I like medals. Alright, in deployment. Turn one. Right, so we have some infantry there, there, cavalry there. Six one. That doesn't seem like a good deal. Let's move forward. Have some anti-air and some this is flak, right? Yeah, it's flak. And then they have some fighters which we need to deal with. You can move up here and take a shot. You can move up here. Actually, let's do that. Move up here because you can unload there. Move you up here. Right. Our bridge guys. Let's first deal with the infantry and stuff. I don't you. Let's see, it's four, five, four, five, two, four, one, four, one, four, two, four. Okay. We'll send you over here. You will send down here. You will send down here for the bonuses. Now move you up here and bombard you. Now I don't want to get in range of their anti-air, so we'll use our tactical bombers over here. And then we'll attack here. Great. They're down to nice. And five, I'll take that. Okay, and now I am happy that I didn't move my fighter, because now we can move in here, give cover to our Stuka, and hit him a little bit more. 
and then you can come in here on the river and take him out. Meaning that this tank can actually cross the river already. Nice. And there's you. One for more. Okay. Not bad. Again, you can come over here, give cover to our, uh, our BF-110 and strafe a bit. And then you, actually you, come down here and take him out. Nice. And that means that you can move forward. 1-5, and it's only a suppression. I'll take that. Nice. So what do we have left? Oh, these guys. I think I'll move you back here and move you in here. Yeah. We have you left. Four two does not seem like a good deal. I think I'll move you over here and send you across the river to do a bit of scouting. And then you can start moving down this way to scout. Okay, there's more infantry here. All right, that's turn one. Haha, <laughs> nice ambush. Ooh, 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 ooh. That just got outright destroyed. I love it. Ouch, seven. That hurts. All right, now our fighters or their fighters are not in range of their anti-air, so we will Take them out. Let's see, what can you do? One, three. I think we'll just... Now, what's your range? Oops. Range two. I want two, so I don't want to be there. Move down here then. Oh, that's my Stuka. Let's not move down there then. One, four. All right, we took it out and we didn't lose any ourselves. Very nice. Now, two, four on you is actually not half bad. But I think what I want to do is. There's actually no enemies that I can see that I can attack with this. Well, that, but... So, you know what? Let's grab you. Head over here and... Do a bit of damage to that. Uh, and you can bombard there. 2-3, alright, that's better. 2-2, two, two, that's not great. But we'll take this. Alright, we pushed him back. So you can get in here now. Nice. And then this tank could actually move over here and take him out. Which I think is exactly what we'll do. Overrun, nice. I do not want to fight there in the woods with the tanks because woods and tanks do not mix. Okay, let's move you down here and see what they have. Oh, there's a PJW there. Some infantry and some artillery. Okay. 2-4. Don't really like those odds. We'll move up here. 
Mm. You come down this way. You come down this way. You head down this way to deal with those. Two, four. Not the greatest. Take that. Alright. We're already up to 744 prestige, so not bad. One four. Take that. And one four. Take that. Oh, it turned out to be two, I think. Uh, okay. You need to move forward. You come up here. I don't think I want anything else over the river here, so... Let's just move down here. Well, I do with those, but it's kind of okay. Hmm. I really want to reinforce you before I move forward. So let's not. And there's you guys. You took that recon out nicely. So we're just going to tell them to sleep forever. You're going to sleep one turn. Sleep one turn. Sleep one turn. Sleep one turn. Sleep forever. Now you could come down here and strafe this guy. Or this guy. Zero three, I like that. Well, it's not a strafe, it's a outright bombing run, but... All right, that's turn two. That was a bad deal for them. Sixth Panzer gained a star. Just pressed five of them, so they won't have that much to attack with. Ouch, three. They took out three of our Stukas. Let's send this BF-109 down here. Two left. Our other BF-109. Come over here. And that should be there. Is that? No, that's the... Our other BF-109 can come down here and finish it off. Nice. And this guy can... Let's just do you. And you can come in here and start working a bit on this artillery. Ow, they took out one of ours. Bastards. One, two. There's an uh, there's a tank gun down there. That's not nice. Nice. You finish that off, and then start moving down this way. Okay. Two, 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 one. Let's replace there. Elite replace there. And we'll move down here. We'll do a mass attack. 
nice. And we'll move down here and finish it off. We'll run. And we can start working on you a bit. One five. I like those odds. So three. Nice. Took him out. Six one. Now the bridge pioneers are not great at combat. If we take a look at him. So soft attack four, hard attack one. They're a bit better at uh, defending, actually. Well, at least ground. Yeah, same as soft attack. Uh, okay. I think we'll just move you up, not attack. You could come in here and take that, but it's a little bit risky because you're down to five strength throw. So I think I'll actually pull you back a bit. Uh, who's selected? Okay, you're selected now. We just stay there. You already fired. Um, you can move up one, I guess. There's this guy. I think I'll just leave you there. And that's it for the turn. Ouch. Three new tanks lost there. Ow, 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 ow. See, the bridging pioneers are not good. Ooh, I did not consider that. Okay, you start working on that. You suppress those, and then we'll send you up here and hit them in the rear. They took their city back, but I don't really care about that. They only have two anti-air left, so I think we'll... This is one. What about... One one. Um. My nice surrender. I love it. Good, good, good. We'll take that town back in the next episode or in the next turn. Actually, we can take it back now if we just move in here. Because unlike in Panzer Corps, in Panzer Corps 2, artillery units, uh, anti-air units, every, every unit except air units can take control of a city. And that is really nice. Um, let's see. Air cannot reach there. Alrighty. Then you can come in here. And you can come down here and suppress a bit. Okie dokie. You need replacements. So do you actually, but we're going to fire on this thing instead. All right, we suppressed and we took out one, so that's nice. And 
down here. Two, three, that's not great. Three, one. So we'll just replace you. And we have you up here. Start coming down this way. Let's actually re elite replace you and you. It takes us back down to 435. What do we have left? You. Yeah, we attack that. And you just stay there. And that's the turn. All right. Ooh. They just might need some reinforcements down there. So we are around the half hour mark, so we are going to end this one here and we'll continue on to Vlodava in the next one. So thank you very much for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.